Good morning and welcome to my vlog. Huh? Yeah, it's my vlog and welcome to my vlog. Ha! Ah. Hey, you! Who, me? Yeah, you, man! What do you want, buddy? Can you tell me what are we watching? Yeah, of course, we are watching. Manoli's vlog and welcome to my vlog. <laughs> Yay. Hello, hello, hello guys, how are you doing? Today is Saturday, it's Saturday or Saturday, and I forgot to tell you that today I'm working at my brother's workshop, yeah. Um, I mean I forgot because uh, he called me last night at about uh, 11 o'clock and he told me that uh, he will need my help because he ain't gonna be here today and so I will have to make a mushroom so we can go to that kindergarten that he's making uh, to place it, yeah. We did the mushroom but uh, we couldn't go uh, to the kindergarten to set up up today and probably we'll do it someday in next week. So I got off from there, I got home and uh, yeah and now I'm, uh, I will uh, get finished with gel song so for the next four or five hours don't talk to me I will be busy, do not disturb Manolis is busy recording and mixing up the song. <laughs> yeah, and at about five o'clock I will go up and get uh, the two workers back to their homes. Yeah, so I am so excited and so uh, pleased for the results so far from uh, for Gel song, and I'm gonna do the final mix now and I'm gonna send it over to Gel. So guys, uh, it's a great Saturday <laughs> so far, and I will see you later. Bye. The time is five, and I'm heading over to pick up the two workers that are working at the workshop to get them to their homes. Um, I'm over with gel song. Yay! Yeah. Um, I'm pleased with the result. <coughs> Although, you know, when a song comes to an end of arrangements and all the recordings, I'm never pleased about the result. Of course I'm pleased. But, you know, because ideas, while I'm listening to the song, still coming and coming and coming, keep coming, keep coming and all that, uh, I will have to decide a time that I will stop recording and stop deleting and recording because if I won't decide that I will probably never finish a song you know um, an artist I believe that an artist is never a hundred percent satisfied with the result of his art but uh, so far I'm pleased for the result okay um, and I think that uh, I think I want to believe that Joel is gonna like it as you can see there are many dogs here yeah that's Frida <laughs> Where's Frida? 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 Where's my girl? Where's my girl? Oh, well, the girl wants to go out. Okay. And these are these are the two <laughs> happy doggies. Where are you? Where are you? Dee -dee 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 -dee. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, this is the mushroom. <laughs> Okay, I'm back home. I'm sitting on my balcony just uh, enjoying a uh, coffee. I usually drink one coffee a day, an early morning coffee. And on Saturdays and uh, Sundays, I drink uh, one afternoon coffee. Uh, I just wanted to, <laughs> to rant for some things. First thing, it wasn't, I wasn't planned to rant about that, but I will. I don't know if you can listen to the music that I'm listening right now. It's not for my house. It's from some neighbor. You know what annoying? What annoys me really, 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 really annoys me. Um, that okay. If you want to listen music loud, just close your doors, close your windows, and listen as loud as you want. Uh, all the neighborhood don't want to hear what you're listening. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Uh, anyway, uh, I'm not gonna make. I'm not gonna say anything about that. But I don't know how may, some people may think of. You know. Okay, I love listening to loud music, but I don't want to disturb anybody else. So I'm closing my windows, I'm closing my room, my door, my room, you know. I don't want to disturb other people. So that is what these neighbors are doing. They're listening to loud music, and I have to listen what they listen. Anyway, the second thing that I wanted to run about, uh, I don't know how many of you, you that are following me for a long time now, probably know that I'm... Uh, I'm having some serious, serious economical problems as a family, not only me. 
We have many debts with uh, and many 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 things. And uh, in a conclusion, we have no money. You know, we are in a very different position. But anyway, um, and uh, you know that uh, I'm struggling every Friday, finding the money, raise the money to pay my workers at, at the office. You know, I have two workers out and one at the office. That makes it three. Uh, every Friday, um, they cost me about uh, $600 every week, three of them. Uh, se seven, almost $700. I don't know if much or a little amount of money, but that's the deal, you know. But uh, I'm trying to pay them on time, you know, and I do. I never left them unpaid. And uh, as, a, as a result, I usually return home on Fridays with uh, $30, 40 dollars in my pocket just for a whole week and that's really bad we can't do anything with that money but because I want to be okay with my workers the thing is yesterday Friday um, because we're gonna close for five days they they have to take some uh, pay, a vacation pay you know uh, every year this year I couldn't raise the money to pay them and I didn't pay them the vacation pay I pay them their weekly uh, profit the weekly paycheck you know and uh, all the guys there are working for uh, for the office because the office uh, was uh, my father had the office before me and for 20 years now so before uh, uh, all three of them workers are working for my father and for me for 20 years now and they threatened me that uh, because I didn't pay them for one time their vacation pay in the whole 20 years they will get me to the court um, I was really sad and really mad about that because I mean I never I never I never I never gave you uh, I never left you without money all of you I'm paying you your insurance I'm paying you your uh, weekly paycheck I'm paying you vacation pay for over than 20 years now and one time because it's a huge crisis and I don't have no work I wasn't able to raise the money and you threatened me that we go into the court uh, I don't know if I'm wrong in this but uh, uh, all of them made families, bought houses, and they were and good for them. They, 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 but, I mean, you don't bite the hand that is feeding you. Oh, God. I don't know if they will do it, finally, if they will get me to the court. But I'm really sad about it, because uh, I didn't do it on purpose. All the money that I had, I gave them to them, and now I have no money for 10 days. That's why I, I can't go on vacations. They will, but I can't go. So, I don't know if I'm wrong, just I want to talk to you, <laughs> I want to rant about it. Um, sorry about that, but you know, I'm having uh, really difficult times in my life. I'm 35 years old and my life is turned upside down for the last three years. And uh, I'm trying my best and I'm doing, and I'm getting well so far, to be happy and smile. And you already know that I am a happy person, despite all the problems that I have, because I have many, many problems. But times like this, I just want to get it out. I just want to run about it. I just want to to get it out because I know that you will understand me. <laughs> anyway, I'm talking too much. I talk too much. I'm going to drink my coffee. Sorry about that. And probably tonight we'll go out with Jim. Again, sorry about that. I just need to get it out because I consider you as a friend. You know. Bye. And that's why I have Melia to cover me. <laughs> hello, Melia. Hello. Say hello. Say hello, Melia. <laughs> yeah. She is a great dog. I love her so much. Bye. Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, I'm watching the Olympics. Anyway, I'm ready. I'm waiting for Jim to come and pick me up. So we're going to have a fun and hilarious night out with Jim. Um, <laughs> uh, again, I'm sorry about my previous rant. Um, I just want to get it out. And uh, I'm sharing my life with you. And I just want to be honest what is happening in my life besides the fun part, you know, which I'm trying I'm I'm getting my life to be happy because if I don't try to get my my life happy I would be so depressed for all these things that I have in mind all the economical problems and the and some health issues that we have uh, in the family anyway guys this is history now let's go and have some fun peace bye uh, look at her she's just waiting for me to go to bed Melia Melia Yeah. Um, sadly, uh, my battery died, and I didn't get the chance to get some footage from my uh, from our night walks with Jim, you know. But Jim said to send greetings to all of you.
the time is 3 15 a.m. and I'm home and I'm about to go to bed uh, it was a great night again with Jim we had a good uh, we had a good time um, yeah so thank you so much guys for your support um, for everything you know hopefully I'm gonna see you tomorrow yeah good night good morning good evening good afternoon wherever you are awesome people out there kisses bye